What should I do? Ah, ich weiß. Get Hallo und willkommen. Ich bin Meister Lenze and you're watching Get Germanize the Marvelous German Meme Review. It's been a while since we raided the last memes. I needed a little break. I thought I want to produce some other content for a while, but I'll always come back to this. Always gonna review the freshest and newest, hopefully, memes. Germany related or not. Mostly Germany related, hopefully. We shall see. If you want to contribute memes for the next episode, then go to my subreddit, get Germanized link in the video description and well, post it. Be active, post regularly, because you never know when I pick the next memes for the next episode. I'd say we'll just get started right away. Lasst uns anfangen. Here we go. Das ist meist wahr. That is mostly true, often true. Nervige Weihnachtslieder sind kein Grund, Anzeige zu erstatten. <laughs> Ihre Polizei. Oh, that's another really German thing. Really German. Uh, annoying Christmas songs are no reason to sue someone basically or to inform the police <laughs> then it says your police force basically your police man yeah anzeige is raus is another uh, german phrase that germans like to use quite often sometimes the most german thing i have ever heard anzeige is raus you're being sued basically <laughs> if you tell that to someone else ah, anzeige is raus anyway this is so german and so true and it's quite funny as well <laughs> is this a real sign must be must be well i would say for this one four out of five sausages next up other countries gonna have a speed limit to keep drivers safe germany i paid the whole speedometer i paid for the whole speedometer i'm gonna use the whole speedometer uh well i mean this is <laughs> it's quite funny um partially true because there are speed limits of course on the autobahn but it's also true that there are parts of it where you can just go as fast as you want or as you can i should probably say because of course there's going to be other cars and uh, yeah if you've ever been on the autobahn you know that if you're on the very left lane that's where the insane people drive <laughs> Uh, you look into your back mirror for a second, see someone really far away, and you look for a second on the street, then you look in the back mirror again and they're right behind you and they are annoyed that you are so slow. That's basically a reality in Germany and this is why this meme is very funny and true. I'll give this also for the truthness factor. Four out of five sausages. Well done. Next up, schön. Bitte, danke, ah, bitte schön, danke schön. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it goes hand in hand. Bitte schön, danke schön. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not really seeing where this is super funny necessarily, but it's true. Um, bitte schön, danke schön. Whoa, strong combination. Bitte schön is basically uh, you're very welcome, and danke schön is thank you very much. Or vielen Dank could also be thank you very much, but uh, Danke schön is like if you add schön to it, like pretty or nice, beautiful, whatever you want to call it, then it's a more polite version. Bitte schön, Danke schön. There you go. Yeah, I mean it's a true meme, not super funny to me at least, uh, but I'll give it three out of five sausages. Next up is. And a meme I actually stole, I think, for my uh, Discord server <laughs> before, so I know this one. Why are into IKEA Germany, says Poland, I guess, to go shopping for kitchen, little Polan, <laughs> shopping list, pan, microwave, bread maker. First on the list is a pan. Va van? Pan. Pa pan? Yeah, ja, pan. And then, why you need me, Germany? <laughs> Japan comes. <laughs> I thought that was so stupid that it's super funny because of it. I don't know. I liked this meme when I saw it first. And so I'll give this four out of five sausages. Next up is, wenn du bei offenem Fenster schlafen willst, weil es heiß ist, aber dein Dorf hat Schützenfest. <laughs> it's so true. I feel this so hard. Ah. Uh, it's like if you want to sleep while the window is open because it's hot, but your village 
as the Hunters Festival. Hunters Festival is basically the the rifle club, the local hunters club. They just usually just, I mean, they also go hunting, yes, some of them, but mostly it's people uh, with like BB guns shooting at uh, little marks. Um, so nothing, nothing too crazy. And they drink a lot. They they meet up to drink as well, and they have hunters festivals, little tent parties, sometimes bigger than others, but tent parties with a fairly large tent where they drink and are merry, and everyone else can go as well. It's like a folks fest, like a party for the people, basically. And if you live in a village, you know when it's Schützenfest because you will hear it throughout the whole village. And uh, so this meme is really funny and really true. Uh, so I'll give it four out of five sausages. Some ask what makes you go five sausages? Well, that would be when I have to really laugh heavily and maybe a tear comes out even. That, that would be five, mostly, in most cases. But yeah, this is good. Next up, Rittersport rapper is Lokey Genius. You know when you know you're German when you know how to open a Rittersport Schokolade. Yeah, I mean, they do have this uh, opening principle basically where there's a te like a little, hmm, how do you say that? Like a weak spot on the back of the chocolate bar and you kind of like crack it in half like this. And then it's open basically at the back. And then you have two halves and then you can tear it open a bit more and then like i guess crack them even more so that you have smaller chunks and then just pick out the chunks um yeah i mean very true meme again not super funny but it's kind of funny not super funny but kind of funny so i'll give it three out of five sausages mm, <laughs> next up german levels of anger or levels of german anger uh mild irritation Indignation, wrath, fury, rage, when there's no bread. <laughs> yeah, um, I mean, I do eat bread. I do eat bread regularly. Yeah, that's a sentence. Um, so I understand this. Yeah, I mean, if you've ever tasted German bread and has to, had to go back to your home country where there is no German bread, then you understand why we Germans would be that furious about not having German bread. It's super delicious. It's super good. It, on my Instagram, actually, I've recently posted like a a pretzel, a mix out of like a normal bread roll and a pretzel and has lots of seeds on top and it's very soft, but also crunchy, um, like crunchy on the outside and, and soft on the inside. And I ate it with camembert cheese, with uh, pomegranate seeds, salami, and uh, just a hint of uh, curry ketchup. And it was it's so good. So, yeah, German bread, nom nom nom. So this meme, very true, uh, I would say, not super funny, uh, but kind of, kind of, four out of five sausages. Deutsches Marketing ist immer direkt. <laughs> German Marketing is always direct. Viagra, rezeptfrei kaufen. <laughs> you can buy it without uh, like a doctor's certificate, I guess. I'll, <laughs> and they put the exhaust. Yeah, okay, I see it, I see it. That's funny. <laughs> I hope this is real and not just photoshopped because it kind of looks like it could be photoshopped, especially there on the white spot above the Viagra pill. It kind of looks a bit dodgy. Hmm. Still funny. I can imagine someone's doing this somewhere in the world. Uh, especially since on the bus there on the left it says something Concercio. Umi Minas. It doesn't look like it's in Germany actually. So this is probably photoshopped. I'll say. For that reason, three out of five sausages. Still funny, but if it's not real, ah, it makes it less funny. Next up, write this in English. Looks like something from like a language app. Wir möchten die heilige Kartoffel sehen. <laughs> We want to see the holy potato. What is this from some, I don't know, is this real? We, I mean, okay, yeah, sure, we Germans like potatoes, the holy potato. This looks like it could be from Duolingo or something like that, because they always have the funniest stuff in there, like the funniest sentences that, 
I mean, the words that the sentence consists of, yes, we use those words, but these kind of sentences, like, we want to see the holy potato. <laughs> Wir möchten die heilige Kartoffel sehen. It's funny though, it's funny, I like it. Four out of five sausages. Next up, Gustav. Bold words for someone 47 kilometers away. Oh yeah, they built those back in the day, didn't they? These massive uh, long distance cannons. <laughs> Well, yeah, bold words. Just, just imagine someone sitting there with his little uh, walkie-talkie talking to like uh, someone from England, in, like German talking to someone in England, like, oh, what did you call me just now? Bold words for someone 47 kilometers away. Well, then again, 47 kilometers is not that far. Maybe if they sit right at the at the beach, I'm not sure. How far is the, how big is that canal? Probably more than, f yeah, must yeah, no, I'm, I'm stupid, must be more. Anyway, still funny. What did you just call me? <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. I thought it was kind of funny. If you're not that, that sensitive. Four out of five sausages. Next up, do they have these jackets? Really? Aldi is the best. Do they have Aldi does? <laughs> okay, it's just fake. Aldi does. It's like Adidas or Adidas, as we say in Germany. Uh, but with Aldi, Aldi does. I was about to say this looks like some PewDiePie merch or something like that. Or yeah, I mean, this color especially, <laughs> this combination. Pewds was, would do that for sure. I am certain. So I don't know. I, I like it. It's funny. Four out of five sausages. Next up, uh, the wonders of German engineering. It said, "Gebrauchte Rollschuhe, used roller skates, 50 bucks." <laughs> Gummi stiefel, so rubber boots, and old office chair roller thingies. Yeah, totally legit. I mean, <laughs> this looks, to be honest, like something that Russians would have come up with, though. There's like a low budget solution to a need some people have. Okay, well, yeah, no, I like it, though. It's funny. Four out of five sausages. That's it for today's job and meme review. I hope you enjoyed it. And like I said, if you want to participate in the next episode, if you want to contribute memes, go to my subreddit, get Germanized and contribute and like this video and share it with people who like Germany, German and German memes or memes in general, because these memes are universal sometimes, or so universally funny at least. And uh, if you really like this channel, consider becoming a patron on patreon.com slash getgermanized or click on the join button next to the subscription button down there below the video or on my main panel, main, main channel page on YouTube. There we go. And apart from that, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to get Germanized. Goodbye and auf Wiedersehen.